It was just my mom and five kids, so we struggled a lot. So I guess I always imagined myself getting to a point where I could take care of my family. My name is Christian Franklin. I was born April 2nd, 1993. Um, my parents got divorced when I was six months. I'm very close with my mom and my siblings. I'm the youngest of five. I'm the baby, and so we're very, very close. I have a relationship with my dad. It's not as close as it probably should be. I guess over time, you kind of build up a little bit of resentment when someone wasn't there for those pivotal points. You know, like those huge times when it comes to like, you know, your first growing up for everything. When you're first getting interested in guys and you don't know, I don't want to just always talk to my mom, you know, like it would have been nice to like, tell my dad like, hey, I have a crush, I don't know what to do, you know, or him to just like, I guess show me what to look for in a guy. We're cordial. It's not that I hate him or anything. It's more or less like, a, um, I just don't know him. Yeah, he lived in um, he lived in Detroit. When we moved up north, uh, we only moved a few hours away. He visited one time when I was 13, and that was actually the last time I saw him. I entertained the thought because my brother brought it up to me. My brother's really close to my dad and he was like, you know, you should get a relationship with them. And you know, I called them and I let him know and he basically kind of just gave me a lot of excuses and it was just pretty much, because what I do is when I'm upset, I block people. And so that's what I did. He, he made me upset my senior year of college and so I blocked him. And so he just, you know, told me like, I don't want to just be in and out of your life. Like, I, I don't think it's nice that you block people. And I was just like, you don't have an authority in my life. Like, even though you're, you feel like, you know, you're my biological father, you weren't there. And so it's like, you don't get to tell me what to do. So, and you know, I'm, I'm cool with seeing him, but I just would rather him just be honest about a lot of things, I guess. At one point he told me he felt like he didn't have a daughter because I didn't call him and stuff. And so it's like, it kind of made me upset that he could ever feel like that because it's a two-way street, you know? Like, you can call me, you can make a trip to California, you know? I want him to be able to admit where he messed up too. If anything huge happens in my life, I take it out on the people around me and I'll just push them out because I'm like, okay, I can control this, so I'm just gonna push you guys out and then it's like, I feel better. And it's because it's the only thing that I can really control. I'm trying, I'm trying to do better where, I'm trying to do better not wasting people's time, which will lead to me blocking less people. So. Happy birthday to everybody born on April 2nd. Thank you for watching. We're uploading an episode every single day featuring a different person. Please like, share, and subscribe. We really appreciate your support.